Yo, what is up everybody? I am back with another video guys and in today's video We're going to be going over the best raid loadout that you guys can use to actually solo clan raids in pixel gun 3d So yeah, hope you guys enjoy Because these are the best raid weapons in my opinion now I've done a lot of clan raids in my time. So yeah guys here we are, um, let me just switch my loadout, obviously, this is not the raid loadout, guys, we're not using the poison dark stuff, so, okay, this is the raid loadout, so, yeah, this is my current raid loadout, but I'm gonna tweak it off, cause I don't really want the wave pulser, like, we, like, yeah, the wave pulser needs to go, we're gonna use a sly wolf for this, but, uh, yeah, let me just hop straight into this match, guys, okay, I'm in the match now, as you guys can see, okay, I got me my ultimatum and my eternal light, and then we got the Crystal Division Melee, and then we got the Sly Wolf and the Demon Catcher and the Better View. So yeah, each of these, they got their own purposes, guys. So pretty much, I am using the Ultimatum. You know, obviously it's a shotgun, and it's going to do like a lot of damage to the turrets. So we will be able to easily kill people with this. And now the reason why I'm using the better view guys in the best raid loadout is actually so we could do more area damage. So it will help us, uh, you know, have more area damage for um, actually like shooting at the guards. So we're going to be able to take out a lot of guards at the same time. But yeah, guys, as you can see, the demon catcher is really OP in this loadout. I mean, we're doing pretty well with it, I would say so. So yeah this is like a must have for like the best raid loadout in my opinion um you know if you guys want to solo raids you know it's you gotta have the demon catcher guys it is really one of the best uh weapons that you guys can use for raids out there in my opinion so yeah melee 2 is really op guys because it will actually heal me and if i had a team right now i would be healing my team but yeah guys the eternal light also is a like you guys can see like it does so much damage to the turrets so yeah this is a must have for soloing clan raids guys and i would recommend you to buying all of these if you haven't already i'm pretty sure you can get the sly wolf and the the what, what do you call that the sniper right here um i'm sorry guys i have a lot of weapons i forget the na names of these but uh yeah i would recommend okay yeah it's called the demon catcher okay yeah, but I would recommend getting the Demon Catcher in the gallery, obviously, because, yeah, it's just a must-have for raids. And, uh, yeah, who knows, guys. The devs might take it out of the gallery. These devs are unpredictable, so, yeah, we'll never know. But, uh, yeah, I'm just going to spam the Bedivere just because the area damage is really, really OP on it. So, it is a nice heavy to have for these raids. And I think we are going to solo it, guys. But keep in mind guys i wasn't against the best for it so i just want to like say that out straight so it's not like the most impressive thing but that doesn't defeat the purpose of this video because this is still like the best loadout that you guys can actually use to solo raids either way in my opinion but let me know what you guys think actually or what you guys use for raids but i thought hey why don't I make this video, you know, maybe it could be helpful for some people. But yeah, with these guards, guys, you're just going to want to make sure you take them out. And if you really have to use something like the Heroic Epe or this um, Crystal Division Melee. And that will heal you really fast. But uh, as you guys can see, yeah, the Bedivere takes out all the guards really fast because it has so much area damage. And then for just damage per second the eternal light is going to be doing the best so we could just get this gate down real quick and uh yeah just capture the flag but uh i hope you guys did find this helpful i might make a video like about all the raid weapons but i thought hey i'm gonna just gonna make a video about my favorite raid loadout but uh yeah i'm gonna do a fuller one soon with just like reviewing a bunch of different weapons maybe with that being said guys let me know what you guys think about this raid loadout for soloing and peace